Can you really paint a sunset painting in just 10 seconds? In today's video, I'm gonna set myself the biggest challenge yet in trying to do this in just that, coming up. Hi again there guys, Emma here from Paint and Pino, giving you some top tips for all things art and design. And today is a little bit different. We're actually gonna try and do a challenge. I was having a recent conversation with somebody in the pub never a good idea when you've had a few beers and they set me the challenge to see if I could actually produce one of these paintings in just 10 seconds. So if you haven't seen this already, this is actually a video I've done previously where I've done this in just one minute. I'll be honest with you, it's impossible. You cannot surely do this in 10 seconds. Can you? <gasps> Now, in order to do this challenge, I'm going to need some extra tools. So what I'm going to use today is just, you know, I've done this trick before. So it's basically two large painter's brushes. These are actually 100 mil brushes that you can get from the hardware store. They're like $5 each. And I've just taped the two together. So that it gives me a really firm standing. Because what the whole point of this is when I want to blend this, I want to try and do it in almost one stroke in order to try and do this in 10 seconds. I, I honestly cannot see how I'm going to be able to do this. I think it's going to take about 30 seconds. But... That's what challenges are there for, to see if we can actually meet them. So let's just go through the paints we're going to actually be using today. So you can see I've already preloaded them onto my um, paper. So I've just gone with the black, the warm red, the cool yellow and the white. There you can see how I tape my brush together because you need to have that firm grip. Now I'll actually want to load up my brush beforehand. So I've never tried this technique before. I have no idea how this is going to turn out. So I think I need to put quite a lot of pigment onto the bristles. But the trick as well is you've got to make sure that these get blended together. Because I've done this before, I've put the paint on the actual canvas. And if you don't actually pre-blend those paints then you just get stripes working across the page. So I want to try and do the same effect using the bristles. So I want to make sure I've covered the whole area because just by good fortune, these two brushes taped together are actually the exact same width of the canvas that I'm using today. So I'm just putting a hint of black at the bottom again, making sure I blend it through and just a very small amount of black at the top, just to give it a little bit more contrast, hopefully with the sunset. So there you go. Fingers crossed this is going to work. Let's put the timer on the bottom. <sighs> Let's see how we get on. Here we go. Oh no, that's not great. Oh, that's better. Okay. Oh my goodness, go, go, go. I need a small detail brush, quick, quick. Oh my goodness, try and get, oh, it's not too great, but it'll give a hint of the reflections. Done. How do I get on? How do I get on? What was the time? How long? 10.28. 10.28. Oh, just, just missed it. Not bad. I did not think I was going to get anywhere near to 10 seconds. I have to say I was, um, I'm actually sweating here. I was pretty stressful. But a lot of fun. Look, guys, the whole point of doing challenges like this is to try and loosen up those brush stroke techniques. I honestly have never done anything like this before. I think I'm about to try and need more challenges. If you would like to see another challenge, just leave a suggestion below, guys, of what you'd like to maybe see me attempt in the future. I'd also like to hear from you guys in terms of what you actually do in terms of speed painting. Have you ever tried it? If not, give it a go. See what you can do in 10 seconds. See what you can do in 10 minutes. Different people work at different paces. So a 10 minute challenge might be just as effective to somebody else as 10 seconds was to me. If you have enjoyed the video guys, then please do hit that like button just below. And if you'd like to see some more challenges just like this one, or regular weekly top tips, we do upload videos every Wednesday and Saturday, then do hit that subscription button and notification below. Alrighty guys, we'll see you next time. Happy painting.